So I'm not sure if you guys saw one of my last posts where I questioned the firing of defensive coordinator Steve Wilkes, formerly of the San Francisco 49ers, uh, after only giving up one touchdown in regulation during the Super Bowl, uh, leading a top three defense, leading the league or having his defense lead the league in interceptions. Um, I got attacked a lot in the comments. Um, just people saying, oh my God, it's, it's not about race. Why? Why do you always have to make everything about race? Black people always want to talk about race. So I was curious, what are some of the main opportunities in the NFL in regards to coaching? Hmm. Okay, so there are 32 NFL teams. There are three main jobs that ultimately get you to that promised land of leading your own team. Most times it's being a head coach already. Maybe it didn't work out somewhere else. So now they bring you in as a head coach here. Or being an offensive coordinator or a defensive coordinator for another team. You showcased, you did well. Now you get to bump up as a head coach for a new team. 32 NFL teams, three positions, meaning there are 96 total available opportunities. Uh, three I couldn't figure out. The Tampa Bay defensive coordinator, somebody let me know who that is. And then the offensive coordinator in San Fran. It need to be somebody because Kyle Shanahan can only get one touchdown in a Super Bowl. And now the newly appointed or vacant scapegoat defensive coordinator in uh, San Fran.